You're listening to Pep's Pods Mostly Haunted. Easter Manor, the most supposedly haunted manor house in Crackbottom, where noises and spooks erupt each night, and where it is said that two people lost their lives during a murder case in the 1960s. In the books of whom time, it is said that Easter Manor has been built upon a plague pit where its victims died and where a curse was placed upon the manor house of whoever who would occupy it. This is mostly haunted and I'm not in their field. Joining me on this spooky investigation this Halloween is my husband, cameraman Carl Snapshot, (laughs) local historian Professor Bertie Pratt, who's been chronicling the building since it was erected in 1800s, don't worry, he's not that old, and world-renowned spiritualist and large medium Derek Adora. Derek, while we stand here at the entrance of Easter Manor, what phenomenons do you expect we shall uh, witness tonight? Well, Yvette, I feel the dark forces are at work. Ooh, ah, just a little bit. Ooh, ah, yes, ah. I suspect this place been haunted. There are many phenomenons and paranormal activities about to happen. Thank you, Derek. Professor, you've been chronicling the building of Crackbottom Easter Manor since it was first erected in the 1800s. Oh, yes, that. Well, we'll see, my family has lived in Crackbottom uh, for many, 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 many moon- moons, and we decided, you know, on, on the, uh, the the outskirts to, to chronicle the life of Crackbottom. It has been said and recorded in time, uh, the Book of Time, that is, that uh, Easter Manor was built on the last plague pit during the medieval times when the plague came to vanish all those who witnessed the the, the, de- the death and the devastation caused by the black plague uh, when it came into this country it has been said that uh, a curse was laid upon this building when three witches who found the plague pit decided to stop any evil forces from erecting is this true professor well, actually, no, I am not quite sure where that one came from, not a vet, but uh, yes, it is said that three bitches, uh, witches did uh, erect a curse upon the manor house and to prevent any evil forces from erupting and erecting themselves uh, throughout the grounds and the many rooms in the manor house. <laughs> Now here we stand in the Great Hall of the Easter Manor, where it is said that during the 1960s, in a murder investigation, uh, Lady Easter lost her life. The tale goes that she was meeting her, how can we put it, a fancy man on the top of the tower. That'll be our next location, where she was confronted in the Great Hall and fled up outside and lost her life. Now, Derek, this place is supposed to be the most haunted room of Easter Manor. Are you picking up any energies that are uh, erupting at this time? Oh, oh, ah, yes, oh, well, um, yes, not yet, in fact, no. But wait, what is that from the window? Oh, oh, yes, ah, 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 yes, I can feel it. Oh, yes, Geronimo, you are touching me somewhere. Ah, Yes, Yvette, there are dark forces here tonight. They are here with us now and may want to communicate with us later on. Thank you, Derek. Over to my husband, Carl, who has taken Professor Bertie Pratt to the haunted tower of Easter Manor. (laughs) 
Uh, uh, do mind where you're stepping. It is rather a, uh, a dangerous uh, tower. This uh, uh, Easter Tower is said to be uh, the second most haunted uh, place in the building. It is said that during the uh, murder investigation in the 1960s of Easter Manor of the 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 cracked egg, uh, that uh, the first victim who fell to his death plummeted and splooched his guts all over the floor, murdered by his missus, uh, mistress, uh, Lady Fiona Easter. If you just stand very carefully... He tours the edge you may even see... <laughs> Now then, what have you two been up to? Yes, I know everything has stopped working. No, don't be silly, there's not a ghost in the machine. I know it's Halloween and all. Yes, of course I paid the electricity bill. And the gas one as well. I mean, they were both very, very um, high, but they did get paid, I think. Well, I'm about 50, 45, 35% certain that I, I, I did pay, pay the bill, even though it was extremely very, very high. Anyway, doesn't matter. Can you sort it out or not? Right, well, get on with it then. Or no song at the end. And now for some jokes about <laughs> Oh, it's alive! It's alive! It's alive! It's alive! Oh, in the name of God! Now I know what it feels like to be God! Are we real? Are we Mary loves dick. Mary loves dick. Uh, uh, uh.